What's up, y'all? Joe, how's it going? All right, I'm just looking at my uh, background through my OBS, and so far I'm liking what I see. It's uh, it's getting there. I moved a few pictures around, just uh, I don't want to be covered in the back of my head. And like, I don't know if you notice in the background, I got three lights here, right? See that? This one I just have it pointed in the back of the wads to like make it seem like I'm some kind of saint or some bullshit. And then these two lights here on the side, I just like make sure that uh, they're kind of like behind my shoulders to like illuminate light so I can look holy and shit. Saint Joe the editor. Fuck. <laughs> so far it's looking cool. And I'm sticking with it. Fuck. Anyways, speaking of saints and shit, <laughs> we want to go see a Dracula movie. And because like I never read the fucking book. <laughs> <laughs> I have to look it up really quick because it was kind of a long name. The Last Voyage of the Demeter. I went with my girlfriend and, I, and another friend and like uh, they're more into you know vampires than I am. Uh, in particular the friend that we went with he's a big fan of vampire movies and shit like that so we invited him to come with us and he, he hasn't read the book yet but he told us that like um, there's a chapter in the book that it's about a voyage where the vampire gets transported to England I believe something like that. I guess in like in the movie um, Bram Stoker's Dracula, you know, with Keanu Reeves and Gary Oldman, that chapter got completely removed from the movie, right? So this is what this movie is based off, is that chapter, uh, just like the, the sailors in the voyage that were starting to die one by one because the vampire was eating them, right? So I guess that's as much as I know about that. Now uh, the movie itself, like, I actually liked it because like it felt like it actually took a lot from the book even though I never fucking read it but I'm just saying like the pacing, the way how it was described, like the monsters and all this shit, like it didn't focus too much on jump scares or crazy CGI. I mean obviously there is CGI but I'm just saying like uh, like the design of like the monster was pretty cool, the vampire, you know, they actually you can see the full on uh, character which I liked, right? They definitely went for a more like Nosferatu like you know, look from the guy which was pretty cool. Uh, the scenes where like people were dying, being burnt and like eaten and all that shit like it wasn't as uh, intense in the sense of like you know, bam bam you know, splash of blood guts and all that but the scenes of like the people dying and suffering and all that shit and like uh, the vampire feet you know feeding off the people, the sailors. Uh, it was actually uneasy to watch and they did a good job with it right so I liked it. <laughs> so uh, yeah it's a good movie. Is it epic and all that crap? Nah fuck no. But that's just me being me because I'm more of a, like a comic book you know superhero kind of movie type of guy where I like to see a bunch of shit everywhere and you know fucking flashing lights and explosions and all that stuff right. But the movie was pretty good. Slow paced, like I said, you know, I think it was like I said, kind of referencing the book, you know, kind of like it built up and shit like that. But I mean, yeah, they did a good job with it. I liked it. So that's uh, one movie and and it's a double feature review today because fuck, <laughs> I've been watching so much movies lately because like uh, since we moved, we haven't been going to the theater. So we've been catching up a lot. Now uh, this movie, my girlfriend really wanted to see. I didn't care for it. Like, because like, I just didn't. Like even watching the trailer, I was like, whatever. Oppenheimer, you know, the guy that like created the atomic bomb and destroyer of worlds or whatever. I'm not, I'll admit, I'm not a big Christopher Nolan fan and I'm sorry if I offended some of you Christopher Nolan groupie motherfuckers because like uh yeah when I went to like film school like uh, a lot of my film classmates they're all fucking like Christopher Nolan groupies and like god damn it and like when I admit like I don't like a lot of his movies I was almost like I just shot their dog or something I don't know. Now I mean I do like Christopher Nolan movies Moment was it Memento was pretty cool I remember we saw that in class it was pretty interesting and Sam shit was pretty crazy, that's for sure. I do like, so I mean, I don't just hate the guy, but I'm just saying like, like sometimes like the way how he tells the stories gets over, it's just too much, you know, like you have to like switch the beginning with the end and the afternoon with the night and all this other shit and like, uh, for me it gets old really. I mean, I don't know. Was the movie good? Yeah. If you're a fan of Christopher Nolan and you like the way how he tells the stories, yeah, you'll love the shit, right? Just like, be sure to eat some food and take some water because it's a three hour movie. <laughs> Me and my girlfriend, we went there at fucking 10 in the morning to go watch it and we stepped outside and it was fucking 1 I was like, God damn it. Okay. It throws you off for a bit. Like I said, it's not for me. Mainly because uh, I just don't like the way how he tells the stories and but that's just me really. But anyways. Double feature review with Joe. No, fuck. <laughs> We've been watching a lot of movies so I'm like, uh, I really don't feel like making this video, making two videos and then scheduling my head at time and stuff like that because like me and my girlfriend we started to go back to the movies and like obviously I like to like uh, post the film review on Friday so I don't want to start posting like film reviews way too ahead of time because you know by the time you watch those film reviews probably be the movie either is out of the theaters or is irrelevant or you know whatever right but anyways that's it anyways talk to you guys later peace <laughs>